you're going to see how the right click works and uh, coming from windows i you know i struggled uh, with the, the right click a lot because normally in windows i keep uh, i do refresh my screen maybe once uh, half hour or an, in an hour so it it's just like uh, or every time i close a window so if i close window i i like to refresh it um uh, this was like started uh, my habit way back in xp where and i had only maybe 256 mb ram so you know somebody told me that it helps to free up the ram uh, i i don't i didn't know it does make a difference or not uh, but it became a habit now i do it right every now and then so on mac yeah i struggle and some, uh, you know you don't have to refresh uh, even though there's a cleanup uh, option but the second uh, one was that i'm so used to working with just mice that uh, mm, you know uh, for deleting especially i will simply right click and delete rather than you know go and find the delete button on keyboard and go there so uh, i i just go with what's the fastest so in that regard um, you know i cannot find the uh, right click and i thought maybe mac does not have one until you know if you have watched all the videos um, i did mention the right click so to, this one is actually the mice and trackpad like how does it work so the <clears throat> the right click on mac is basically uh, if you have, if you have the like magic mouse probably you have the button but uh, on the macbook you have to uh, put two fingers on the trackpad and then you know press and there is your right click you can see there's a new folder get info that uh, i use a lot um, i just like to know the status um, you know so i'm very much uh, into numbers so i use that in windows its properties I do uh, use it heavily and uh, sort by and this so there was an op uh, there was actually just a while ago there was a clean up option coming over here I don't know where it went yep it's not it's okay I don't know what's uh, there was a clean up option maybe it's just one off so Anyway, so that's the right click. Next one is the trackpad. So trackpad uh, on the older Macs, there were, ah, okay, actually, I just found something new. Uh, let's uh, talk about the older one. Older one had two buttons on the top, so you could use it, but with the newer model, be it a Mac or Windows, they have uh, uh, parted away from the, uh, the buttons. So all you have is the trackpad, and you have to do different things on it first so some trackpads have on the top that is more sensitive like right side or left side this one i just found that if you swipe with hmm, i don't know why okay so <laughs> i am finding things ah okay so basically what's happening over here is two finger three finger four finger palm okay i don't know why it's not working but uh, i'm trying to find this this menu appears i don't know how this one uh, no not this one actually this one this one is uh, popping up by just by swiping like on the trackpad and it's from right to left like to pop it up you have to right to left and to send it back left to right mm. right, there you go so you have to go all the way at the edge and then do it and to send it back you don't have to go to the edge but definitely to bring it up you have to go all the way uh, maybe a little bit outside of the edge to bring it up cool 
So nothing happens from the left side, nothing happened from the top, and nothing happened from the right. Ah, actually, uh, swiping up from the bottom, this brings up these um, many, uh, uh, this bar, and basically if you have seen my Windows uh, virtual desktop, I believe that's what it is. You can add more desktops here, and you can switch how you can have uh, different virtual desktops where you have one set of uh, uh, programs running on one, and then you have another one running on that. We'll get to if we have to in a later video. So let's go to uh, the mouse and trackpad options. Uh, we'll go to the system menu or Apple menu and then we'll go to system preferences and here you have trackpad and mouse since I have a MacBook so probably I will have nothing in the mouse except for the pointer uh, this will be for the yep no mouse found so you can turn on Bluetooth and connect a um, magic mouse but I'm gonna go back and go into the trackpad so you can see that uh, uh, here is here it's actually giving you a demo of what will happen so look up date and detectors force click with one finger what that mean tap with three fingers so point and click and you can see there is two if you keep watching this video it will show you a different thing secondary click is click with two fingers set up right here uh you can do it click on the bottom right corner that bottom right that will become your right click and click on bottom left corner so you can set up how you want it did bottom left would be for us anybody who is uh, left-handed probably now you can go to tap to click tap with one finger or two finger how you want to do this is the sensitivity uh, settings force clicked and haptic feedback ah, okay that's that's nice that you can press family for a uh, quick look and it will show you I will try with something now let's go to scroll and zoom now you can have see what different uh, properties are and actually when you go hover over something the this video on the right side changes and it will actually tell you what the, do they mean smart zoom is basically double tap i i was thinking maybe it's like an iphone that you can uh, um, zoom in and out with your thumb and the uh, left index zoom in and out oh that's zoom in and out just like that yep and scroll direction uh, naturally is two fingers it's pretty much common uh, across any laptop windows or mac and now it's two, scrolling up and down with two fingers so this is actually pretty pretty uh, neat that they have this uh, video on the side and that actually is giving you what's swipe between full screen apps Oh yeah, that was the notification center that I uh, found uh, uh, by accident and I was talking earlier in this video. You can see that you actually have to go from the outer edge into the trackpad. So, mission control. Ah, okay, three fingers is... Uh, uh, Windows have something uh, at work, uh, laptop. Yes, it's three... three, uh, three uh three swipes and on the desktop there is actually uh, a way to see all of them so launch pad hmm. that is neat and show desktop let's actually try this it, it's not working for me the show desktop thumb and th oh th thumb and three finger actually it, it worked for me all right so that was it now what's the length pinch with thumb and three fingers there you go there is your launch pad full and i'm gonna go back 
swipe with three fingers up and that ah that's what's called the uh, mission control uh, so in windows it's virtual desktop in mac it's mission control nice so really neat let's wrap this video here i hope this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one